Hi, my name is Nadira Amira Binti Arifin. My name is Daniel Batrish Moxin Bin Abdullah. Hi, I'm Sharifa Sofina Saltimon Said Hashim. Hello, my name is Muhammad Iman Daniel Bin Haji Awang, and we are from Team Scientific Enigmas from Slavna Brakas and from Rider Salam. In April 2023, Rina experienced an unprecedented rise in temperature, a trend reflecting global climate change. This surge in heat posed a significant challenge to the people of Brunei. People were exposed to extreme heat, including to fatigue, heat stress, and even collapsing. Something had to be done to ensure the well-being of the individuals in such conditions. That's when the Aquacool Evaporation Cooling Fluid Project was born, a visionary solution designed to combat the harsh Brunei heat. Our goal was clear, to develop a cooling suit that's reliable, efficient, and easy to wear. To achieve this, we delve deep into the principles of thermodynamics and heat transfer. Our team combined innovative technology with advanced materials to regulate the body's temperature while ensuring user comfort. The AquaCool suit is composed of three layers that work together to create a cooling effect. Let's take a closer look at each layer. The first layer of the suit is the outer layer, which is made of a lightweight and breathable fabric that is capable of absorbing heat from the surrounding environment. The second layer of the suit is the cooling layer. This layer is designed to facilitate the process of evaporation, which is the key mechanism behind the suit's cooling effect. When water is added to this layer, it absorbs the heat and evaporates, which causes a cooling effect. This layer is typically made of a highly absorbent material. The third layer of the suit is the innermost layer. It is made using waterproof fabric. The purpose is to prevent any excess water to seep out and reaching the user's skin which might cause discomfort. The air pockets in this layer are specifically designed to create a flow of air that helps to maintain a consistent temperature throughout the suit. As the cooler air generated by the evaporation process is circulated through the air pockets, it helps to cool down the wearer's body and prevent the accumulation of heat. The suit is equipped with three fans, with the first two located at the bottom. These fans are used to push the warm air from the process of evaporation out of the suit. This helps to prevent the accumulation of heat within the suit and increases the rate of evaporation. The top fan is used to circulate the cool air generated by the evaporation process throughout the body. This fan pushes the cool air between the second and the third layers of the suit. It works by drawing in the cooler air from the second layer and circulating it throughout the suit, enabling it to reach the wearer's body. The water reservoir is located at the back of the suit and is designed to hold around 500 milliliter of water. The amount of water needed will depend on the expected duration of use. To wet the second layer of the suit, water is pumped from the reservoir into the second layer. There are actually two ways in which the suit operates, autonomously and manually. Let's first talk about the autonomous mode. In this mode, the suit is equipped with sensors that detect changes in temperature and humidity. If the conditions are appropriate for evaporative cooling, the process will start automatically. The suit's technology will detect the need for cooling and initiate the evaporation process, providing continuous cooling for the wearer. To activate the manual mode, we can use the mobile app that comes with the suit. The app allows us to control the amount of water pumped into the second layer, giving us control over the cooling process. The fans play a critical role in the evaporative cooling process as they push warm air out of the suit while circulating cooler air throughout the body. Our project is not only driven by the desire to create an effective cooling suit, but also our commitment to addressing several sustainable development goals outlined by the United Nations. Let's explore how our project aligns with these goals. SDG3, which focuses on good health and well-being, resonates strongly with our project. Our evaporating cooling suit plays a vital role in maintaining regular body temperature and preventing heat exhaustion. SDG9 highlights the importance of industry, innovation, and infrastructure. Through our project, we embrace this goal by developing innovative technologies and materials. Our cooling suit demonstrates our commitment to pushing boundaries and exploring new possibilities in the field of wearable cooling solutions. SDG 12 emphasizes responsible consumption and production. We are proud to align with this goal by incorporating sustainable materials and production methods into our cooling suit. Lastly, SDG 13 urges us to take action against climate change. With our evaporative cooling suit, we support these efforts by providing individuals with a sustainable and effective solution to combat the impacts of extreme heat. By aligning with these sustainable development goals, our project goes beyond the scope of a mere technological innovation. In 
exemplifies our commitment to creating a positive impact on society and the environment. Thank you.